Money Time! Then no breaking, no free king. It's not that hard to understand. And if it is, then you, Tester, are in dire need of some English lessons. This is a level pack for an old educational tape I have. It should teach you some basic English Maybe then you'll finally understand me. Oh, by the way, a cake will be available at the conclusion of the lesson. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 17, exercise two. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. What else is on the table? Correct. A sink and an empty glass are on the table. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise 3. Examine the picture. Where is the cat now? Yes, the cat is in the bedroom. Linda and Mary really like their black dresses and their amazing white cat. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise 4. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. Very good. Now, what are these objects for? Now describe the cat's actions during this situation. This sounds wonderful. Read the last question aloud and share your thoughts on the given subject. You did very well. This concludes exercise four. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 18. Exercise 5. Let's look at the picture. This is a dog. Is she a good doggy? No, she is a bad doggy because she often steals sausages from the refrigerator. Let's say together. Bad doggy. Bad. Tonight you will sleep outside. Page 18. Exercise 6. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high. The weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared. The sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life, but her loud cries, to her own demise, have awoken the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Did the doggy deserve to stay outside? Very good answer. She got what she deserved. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Wuff! That's right. A cat says, Meow! Correct. Are all cats dumb? No, just this one. This concludes this lesson. This is the end of side A. Please turn over to side B. What was that? What the hell was that? I won't accept it. And remember that cake? Well, forget it. Because for a performance like that, life has prepared you another gift. Oh!
Boom! Lemons all over your life! I think I'll have to enable the duck after all. No, no, that could ruin the game. Yeah, you learned nothing. Spricken the English, por favor? Uh-huh, yeah, I thought so. Go and finish my course! They should match, okay? The green is on the left! No, wait, my left. Your right? Why bother? It puts the pieces in the box. What? Uh, what's this supposed to be? You are wrong and nobody likes you. It's a pizza. Surely there's nothing you can ruin in a pizza. Okay, I'll take the middle piece then. What's the S stand for? It's not an S. In our game, it means five. It's an achievement! <laughs> Don't judge. It's hard to come up with jokes. As I like to say, just put it in the green one. Should I explain how wrong this is? Oh, oh, you should build a rocket. Just don't forget to clean up afterwards. Hey, you dropped one. Or was that on purpose? <laughs> Solve this correctly, okay? Not like the last one. That meat is a symbol of all the problems in your life. Stop avoiding it! You know like in a restaurant after food kids get crayons to draw? Well, your job is to put it all back. They should match, okay? Hooray! You managed to match colors! It puts the pieces in the box. Your conscience is clean. Also, your room. Here's another order. Cut this one, too. I bet you're gonna eat it all by yourself. And 
another puzzle about putting stuff in the boxes. It's like a theme here. I know you wanted to draw something fun, but don't worry. It'll be possible later in the game. Quick, raise your hands. We're gonna do a little stretcher. Don't touch anything. Thank you for your cooperation. Increasing the difficulty. You'll need one click to solve this. Good, I hope you know how to use them. A wet puddle is blocking your path. What will you do? Slow and steady wins the game. You did it! You can be good after all! So, I made a trophy for you. Except that I didn't. I ran out of ideas. Copied a puzzle from before, and voila! It's your problem now. You build your trophy, and don't forget to have fun. But not too much fun, I hope. Kids could be watching. Here we go! Lesson three, domestic animals. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise three. Examine the picture. Where is the cat now? Yes, the cat is in the bedroom. What can we say about cats? Exactly. Cats are weird. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise 4. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. Very good. Now, what are these objects for? Very good. This concludes exercise four. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 18, exercise five. Let's look at the picture. Let's say bye-bye to the doggy together. Bye-bye, doggy. Page 18, exercise 6. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high. The weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared. The sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life. She was jumping high, kissed the moon goodbye, and didn't disturb the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Was the doggy very good in this fragment? Very good. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. 
Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Woof! That's right. A cat says, Meow! Correct. And why do they do it? To get your attention. This concludes this lesson. This is the end of side A. Please turn over to side B. Hey, I see you have finished. Very good. <laughs> Classic. So, did you like it or was it too challenging? By the way, as you can see, I wasn't lying about the cake. A cake and new pack? Do you have a birthday or something? So many presents! This puzzle is with a little twist. Something to keep you on your toes. Ta-da! Surprise language test! How do you pronounce it? And you're dead! Better luck next time. Just in case, this drive is very valuable. It contains all my <clears throat> research materials. So what, now you're gonna blow up my data too? Too lazy to do two extra clicks? You have ruined both puzzles. Couple more and you'll be in big trouble. Cut it. Just let it charge. No! Stop it! Stop it! I'm giving you one last chance. You blow it and it's over. I'm super serious. I think that will do. Put the phone down. No one needs this much photos of your stupid cat. <sighs> no, enough. I'm done. Taste my duck, you naughty player. I mean, it's your fault, you know. I have to use it on you. Warning, latest version. Yeah, yeah, I know. Unstable. Activate duck. God, freaking yes! Oh, damn it. Yes! Hasta la... Mm. Why is it twitching? Well, I know Duck wasn't finished, but... Why so many glitches? Is it that broken? Oh my god, he's gonna crash the game! Oh, uh, there! Uh, just as planned. The Duck is activated, and you won't even have a chance to mess with the game again. You'll see how my flawless technology works. Go on, try to do something bad, eh? Oh, you found a bad solution? Congratulations! Now, look how my duck will undo this. What the hell? It's still bad? No, 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 no. Let's try again. Same puzzle. 
Okay, let's do a good solution then. <sighs> it's right there. Move him to the back. Back! Go back! Know your place! Okay, good! What? What's going on? Why did he move? Did you do that? Again. Hi, hi, it's funny.